Ashigayon by David, which he sang to the Lord concerning Cush the Benjaminite. I put my trust in you, Lord my God. Deliver me from all my pursuers and save me, lest he tear my soul like a lion, crushing me with none to rescue. Lord my God, if I have done this, if there is wrongdoing in my hands, if I have rewarded my friends with evil or oppressed those who hate me without reason, then let the enemy pursue and overtake my soul. Let him trample my life to the ground and lay my glory in the dust forever. Arise, O Lord, in your anger. Lift yourself up in fury against my foes. Stir me to mete out the retribution which you commanded. When the assembly of nations surrounds you, remove yourself from it and return to the heavens. The Lord will mete out retribution upon the nations. Judge me, O Lord, according to my righteousness and my integrity. Let the evil of the wicked come to an end, but establish the righteous. O righteous God, searcher of hearts and minds, I rely on God to be my shield, he who saves the upright of heart. God is the righteous judge, and the Almighty is angered every day. Because he does not repent, he sharpens his sword, bends his bow, and makes it ready. He has prepared instruments of death for him. His arrows will be used on the pursuers. Indeed, he conceives iniquity, is pregnant with evil schemes, and gives birth to falsehood. He digs a pit, digs it deep, only to fall into the trap he laid. His mischief will return upon his own head. His violence will come down upon his own skull. I will praise the Lord according to his righteousness, and sing to the name of the Lord Most High. For the Conductor, on the Gittit, a psalm by David. Lord our Master, how mighty is your name throughout the earth! You, who has set your majesty upon the heavens, out of the mouths of babes and sucklings, you have established might to counter your enemies, to silence foe and avenger. When I behold your heavens, the work of your fingers, the moon and the stars which you have set in place, what is man that you should remember him, son of man that you should be mindful of him? Yet you have made him but a little less than the angels, and crowned him with honor and glory. You made him ruler over your handiwork. You placed everything under his feet, sheep and cattle, all of them, also the beasts of the field, the birds of the sky, and the fish of the sea, all that traverses the paths of the sea. Lord our Master, how mighty is your name throughout the earth. For the Conductor, upon the death of Laban, a psalm by David. I will thank the Lord with all my heart. I will recount all your wonders. I will rejoice and exult in you. I will sing to your name, O Most High. When my enemies retreat, they will stumble and perish from before you. You have rendered my judgment and defended my cause. You sat on the throne, O righteous judge. You destroyed nations, doomed the wicked, erased their name from all eternity. O oh, enemy, your ruins are gone forever, and the cities you have uprooted, their very remembrance is lost. But the Lord is enthroned forever. He established his throne for judgment, and he will judge the world with justice. He will render judgment to the nations with righteousness. The Lord will be a stronghold for the oppressed a stronghold in times of trouble. Those who know your name put their trust in you. For you, Lord, have not abandoned those who seek you. Sing to the Lord who dwells in Zion. Recount his deeds among the nations. For the avenger of bloodshed is mindful of them. He does not forget the cry of the downtrodden. Be gracious to me, O Lord. Behold my affliction at the hands of my enemies, you who raises me from the gates of death so that I may relate all your praises in the gates of the daughter of Zion, that I may exult in your deliverance. The nations sank into the pit that they made, in the net they concealed their foot was caught. The Lord became known through the judgment he executed. The wicked one is snared in the work of his own hands. Reflect on this always. The wicked will return to the grave, all the nations that forget God. For not for eternity will the needy be forgotten, nor will the hope of the poor perish forever. Arise, O Lord, let not man prevail, let the nations be judged in your presence. Set your mastery over them, O Lord, let the nations know that they are but frail men. Salah.